Alright, and welcome back to part 4. In the previous video, I made a mistake. The uh, hanging wall spiders are wall skulltulas. Yeah. No, it's skull wall tula. Anyway, those, uh, those guys right there, those guys are Deku Babas. Can't believe I couldn't remember that. There are a lot of enemies, I don't know how many I'm going to get accurate. But, uh, moving along here, what am I supposed to do? Oh, right, right. We have to, uh, bring the flame across to burn that web. So, let's climb up here. Light our Deku stick once again. Jump across, avoiding the water. And pressing the R1 button to crouch down and burn all the... Yeah. <laughs> Whoa. You see that? <laughs> Link ricocheted off the wall. That was pretty cool. Alright, so remember that puzzle? The key combination? 23 is number one. Come here. Okay, this last guy. Oh, uh, you, you gotta be the troublemaker, huh? Oh, you're gonna get yours, buddy. Uh, okay, just run up to it quickly. Without doing that. And, uh... <laughs> He'd give you something. Let's try it again. You gotta be quick on your feet. There we go. How did I know your secret? Well, y your brother kind of ratted you out, man. I mean, I, I check into family ties because uh, <laughs> I wouldn't invite him to the family reunion. <laughs> oh, Queenie. Well, now you're betraying your loyal queen. Alright, time for the boss fight. It is the Arachnid Queen Goma. See if you can spot her. I don't see anything yet. As the camera swoops in on her face, you'll see the sheer tear on it. There we go. <laughs> okay, so I hear it. I thought I saw an eyeball in the darkness. Where's she at? Oh, up there. If I could get the C camera right. And there's our first boss. She's not too hard at all. Parasitic armor directed to Just to stun her and keep hitting the eye. That's all you gotta do. Okay, now, there is a second phase to her attacks. She does uh, crap out babies or mini gomas or whatever they are. Goma larvas. But I'm not going to allow that to happen. I'm just going to bash away here, see if I can put her away. Alright. Now that phantom enemy is just a fading memory. It was not too hard. Not gonna lie, that was not too hard. I hope the rest of the game is exactly like that. Here's a full heart container. As you can see, our health has increased to four hearts from three hearts. Yeah! And Link's, like, pelvis, like, he leans back as he goes up. Ah. Uh, beam me up, Scotty. <laughs> Had to make that reference. Well done, Bloom Tide 42. Alright, let's see what the Deku Tree has to say. Thou hast verily demonstrated thy courage. I knew that thou wilt be able to carry out my wishes. Now I have yet more to tell ye, lest thou listen. Yeah, of course. We're gonna be the savior of Hyrule here. Now listen carefully, a wicked man of the desert cast this dreadful curse upon me. So, the Deku Tree was a man or something?
almost never allow the desert man in black armor to lay his hands on the sacred Triforce. Thou must never suffer that man with his evil heart to enter the sacred realm of legend. That evil man who cast the death curse upon me and sat my power. Because of that curse, my end is nigh. Though your valiant efforts to break the curse were successful, I was doomed before you began. Yes, I will pass away soon, but do not grieve for me. I have been able to tell you of these important matters. This is Hyrule's final hope. 142. Go now to Hyrule Castle. There you will surely meet the Princess of Destiny. Take the stone with you, the stone that man wanted so much that he cast the curse on me. Alright, our first treasure. One of the sacred gems. Kikiri's Emerald! Alright. You might notice that I didn't talk during the cutscenes. I feel it's more epic. The future depends upon thee, Blunt 42. Thou art courageous. Navi the fairy, help Blunt 42 to carry out my will. I entreat ye, Navi. Goodbye. Let's go to Hyrule Castle, Blunt 42. That was kind of epic. <laughs> Could find a great Deku Tree. Yeah, right as the uh, Deku Tree died there, the uh, my garbage man came by to pick up my trash, and I'm sure you guys can hear it. <laughs> hey, Blunt 42, what did you do? The great Deku Tree, did he die? How could you do a thing like that? It's all your fault. Yeah, it's all my fault. It's all my fault that the Great Deku Tree couldn't survive. But he was doomed before I started. That's that's pretty like depressing, right? So I had no chance. Ah, whatever. This is a uh, let's see. We have to plant a magic bean there. That is a patch of soil. And sometimes you could drop bugs in them to uh. Fish out gold scotulias. You can see that guy stop wanking it. Anyway, let's go to the forest. Alright, <laughs> let's exit the forest. Forest folks should not leave the woods. Well, I'm not a true Kikiri, so eh. I can break the rules. Oh, you're leaving. That's so sad. I knew that you would leave the forest someday, Blunt 42. Because you are different from me and my friends. But that's okay, because we'll be friends forever, won't we? I want you to have this Arcarina. Please take good care of it. Oh, I will. And Link's like tripping and balls that he finally got a gift from his girlfriend. Yeah. Here you see the fairy ocarina. Alright guys, I have to call it into part 4. See you guys for the next part.